think we've ever seen so many caves, have we? No. And there's just so many caves. Look, I'll show you. <laughs> I want to go in that one. It looks like it goes in quite a way as well, doesn't it? Look at these caves. And Bear went on and on and on and on and made me stop to go in. I felt really bad not doing it. Obviously, Daddy's not going to do it. Are you, Daddy? We did this last year. Yeah, we did do this last year. So I'm going to go in with them. I can't fin because my ankle's still busted. I can't fin. But I'm going to just swim over with them and let them swim through the cave. Thanks, Mum. God, that's so exciting in your life. There's no point getting past all these caves without swimming in them, is there? Yeah, and, and they'll be able to come with us. <laughs> We're taking you with us. Yeah. See you in a minute. I'm Nikki, and this is my gorgeous family. Chris, Bo, Bear, and our salty puppy, Buddy. We've been sailing around the world for three years now on Pickle, a catamaran we bought, renovated, and learned to sail on after I had a life-changing epiphany when I was in ICU with meningitis. Subscribe, welcome aboard, and enjoy the ride. Having the old pooch. You won't be able to. I'm over to there to have a look. It's quite deep here, 30, about 32, 33 meters. Go on then, you climb out. 
Okay. Wow. That was so cool. That is yeah. very cool. Ah, <laughs> oh, buddy. Cool. There's a cable to a cave in there. Yeah. There's like a massive, massive rock. Oh shit, I've got jellyfish on me. What? Serious? Oh man, that's 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 really stinging. Can you back in water? That's a that's a that's a box. And baking soda! I've been running down my legs. Yeah. Give us it. Give us it. Okay, hurry up. Thanks. Oh my god. You need to Where get that. Where's the big rock? I think he's just got a jellyfish on her. It was a box jellyfish. One of the ones with the four tentacles and then the long one. Yeah, it was just all wrapped around my arm, like all stuck to me, like stuck in me. Yeah. Like they're jelly, but they're stuck in there like little tiny well claws, I suppose. My mum pulled the net out. What would be funny though, wouldn't it? Hey? That just down mountain. Yeah, it is. Crazy. 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 Look at that. Daddy's just spotted. Like some sort of church on top of that outcrop of um, rocks. Like a little <laughs> island of a church, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know how you get to it. That's it, you see the pirates off. Come on pirates, we dare you to try and board us. <laughs> He's barking a silly little, little, little tiny boat. You're so silly buddy. But well, that's really cool. I don't know why it's got a church or something on it, but it's really cool. How oh, buddy, it's good isn't it? It's as good as those goats. <laughs> Dolphins, buddy! It's dolphins! Dolphins out there today? I don't know. Jellyfish, fish, goats, dolphins, we've seen it all. Yeah. <laughs> Go down then. So we're just 4. going. 8, 8. 4. 6. We're just going over this shallow bit, which is getting alarmingly shallow now. 4.6. That didn't look 4.6 inside of us, that Nicky. What does it look? They're like big fucking rocks. 4.2. Look, look. 3.9. What are you doing? Stand to me. Okay, so we're nearly, we're nearly in channel, we're nearly in channel now. That looks shallow there though. Mum, is this where the sand is? It's it looks... be in the channel now. The red marker's there. Surely this is in the channel. Yeah, it's... maybe. It looks... Yeah, you'd think so, but it looks shallow there. Five metres. That looks crazy shallow. It definitely doesn't look like five metres. It looks like about two, but water's so clear. So anyway, there's... So there's a little island here. And there's like a little channel and it's really wow. shallow here. Oh, it's gone deeper Back now. Back up again. We're definitely in channel in. now. Because we want to go over there. Oh, it was a bit bit air raising then a minute ago. Definitely didn't look five metres, but like it's I said. Point four now. Water's so clear. Yeah, it's going back up. We're definitely in channel now anyway, but there's a sandbar comes off that edge, little 
headland there and it runs straight across there somewhere and it gets quite shallow there so we're hoping maybe we might be able to cross it when we go out to explore that way but today the anchorage we are going straight down there to anchor so we can have a walk around old town which is there tomorrow in the like fort walls cool have a bit of an explore Hopefully it won't be swimming boyed off too far. He's got his little baby friend. Oh, do you like your teddy bears? Do you like your teddy bear? Very yeah, cute it. teddy bear. <laughs> so we're on a mooring. Just picked up a little mooring. Oh my God, Chris, the size of this fish. It's a mullet. Hello, fishy. It's like a humongous. It's like a ten pound fish. It's like Just randomly swimming past the boat. I'm getting the spin rod now. Someone's shouting over there. Anyway, guys, this is where we've anchored. Sorry, zoomed out. This is where we've anchored. There's a big sandbar that runs from that island all the way across to there. And we're in quite shallow water. I think it's like four meters, but we're on a boat. It's fine. Look at that cloud. Look at the cloud. <gasps> It's like you get a tabletop mountain, isn't it? Where would it focus? Focus. There, look at that. How cool is that, guys? Very, very cool. Just shows you how big those mountains are. Very misty today. We're going to go and anchor on that little island tomorrow or the next day, just out there near the bar, so we can do some snorkeling and stuff and have some fun in this bay. That's the little red submarine. Look at that, little red submarine, we've seen that all over the Mediterranean. There must be a thing, there must be several of them. Good on your company that supply them. It's like having a glass bottom boat, but in a submarine. This is Budva. It's quite busy for this time of year. You've still got lots of people in the restaurants and bars, which is nice to see. And that over there is Old Town. We might have a little walk around there. Definitely gonna wear some shorts on, oh, buddy. You wanted a good or did you? Oh, you're a good boy. You're a good boy, aren't you? You're a good boy. <laughs> and I can't catch the mullet. Good luck. So this is us. This is us. I've just done dinner, which actually was, was really, it? really nice. Oh. There is trying to get the majorly huge mullet that just swam past. Yeah. And it was, it was right there, but I spit it, it off. But it tough as soon as he tracked his spinner in. Anyway. It's one over to it. Hopefully, it should be a nice evening. We haven't had anybody come out and try to charge us for the boy yet. Good. Assuming they might, though, because it's still quite busy, so I'm assuming they, they might, but we will we will see. No problem, eh? Yeah. You can see, actually. Look all the way down, it's so clear. It goes, the boy, and it goes all the way down there to there. Can you see? I'm not sure if you can see. It goes all the way down. Four and a half metres. It's a big concrete slab. It's rope onto chain. Yeah. And we just Sorry. loop it on deck.
Um, slushies. Beautiful location to sit and drink your slushies. Yeah. <laughs> We've covered a bit of shopping spree because it's Bo's birthday in a couple of days. Yeah. So we oh, get a bit of shopping. She's already found the top and some jeans. That's so nice. It was so good. It's such a good find. Little boutique shop down there. It was great. So she's already got some bits and we got some new charging leads we needed, didn't we? And she got a new case. Yeah. Can't really this see that one kind of came plug. with a USB thing where you just plug the lead into it instead of a plug. And now we're sitting in this really beautiful park under the shade of this fabulous tree. Can you see it? I love this tree. I wanted to stand there when we were taking off to the rest. Yeah. This morning I got up, yesterday, right, so yesterday we were walking the dog last night and he was being an absolute arse, pulling like a crazy fall, jumping about on the lead, and I swung the dog rip lead like that, the end of it, and it whacked him right in the eye. Obviously, it was an accident, I didn't mean to hit him in the eye with the dog lead. Um, but he was like, it was like this, kept like shutting his eye, and I was like, proper panicked, I was like seriously upset, like really upset, had a few tears. I thought I'd really hurt the dog's eye. I was like really worried. And it's bad when mum cries because I don't she cry. doesn't cry. No, I don't cry. I, don't. I was really upset that I'd hurt the dog accidentally. I honestly I was really upset. So um, I worried all night. And then this morning I woke up and it was all right. But he kept still doing this, like closing it. Like he's, obviously it's hurting. And I'm like, oh, is that bruised? Is it just a bit of bruise where the, you know, like the, the eyeball is so soft and it? it'll rattle the tissue around your eye so soft. I suppose if a big chunky lead, his lead's made from one of our Janar ropes, so big heavy lead, hit you in the eye, it's going to hurt, isn't it? And I thought, is it just how is it so wrong with his eye? Anyway, I was worried. I thought I should need to get it checked out. So I Googled the vets and then me and Bear got up early and we walked like a kilometre and a half to a vet's and they were really really lovely they put like dye in his eye and checked the, the lens that the it wasn't scratched or anything there's no scratch there's no infection there's no anything it's just <laughs> sore when I whacked him with a dog lead the poor sausage in the eyeball <laughs> so um, yeah he's absolutely fine so give him some eye drops just to soothe his eye you know so that it didn't hurt like an anti-inflammatory and uh, yeah the thing is when we got to the vet he was so excited and jumping around open. like crazy his eyes were fully open like he this. wasn't he wasn't doing that at all and I'm like he hurt his eye and they're like where's he hurt his eye and I'm like he has honestly he's been doing this all morning <laughs> and they're like okay so they did all the checks uh, but when he calmed down he did start doing that again so they did sort of see that he did actually have something wrong with his eye because it looked like he didn't and he did anyway so he's fine they give him some eye drops just you know in case it's inflamed but He's absolutely fine. And actually, he's keeping his eye open mostly anyway. And on the way back, um, we bought him dog toys, more dog toys, which he really needs. So he's very happy now. He's had a pig's ear to eat, and he's got lots of new dog toys. So he's happy. And on the way back, we walked past this tree, and Bear was like, come and sit under that tree. And I'm like, no, we need to get the dog back and need some water and stuff. You know, you know, we should get back. And uh, so we didn't. So now we're sitting under this beautiful tree, having a little drinky poo before we continue shopping. And Daddy didn't really want to come, you know, and wait outside shops and stuff with the dog and what have you. So he stayed back on the boat. Yeah. So we've so got just, Which is a lot easier, anyway, without raspberry. grumpy daddy and a, a dog waiting around for us. Oh, uh, raspberry. I don't know. That's great. Very nice. That I, I didn't, I didn't get a cup. Obviously, it's got a normal cup because I'm an adult. I'm not really silly, wouldn't I, with a children's cup? No. Anyway, my fellow Delicious. friends. See you in a bit. I'll show yes. you what else to go up to. I just fixed the slushie. I just fixed the slushie. <laughs> 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 what are you doing up there, you little pixie? Drinking my slushie up there. I've just finished it. They're like a goat. This is actually really complicated to sit on. Oh, you're a bear, aren't you? Bears do climb trees, don't they? Yeah. Panda bear. You knew when you named it. <laughs> no, no, you knew when I, you called me that. Hey. I believe just hit me in the face. How funny is that? <laughs> These leaves up here. Fell <laughs> down, landed up here. Right, climb down really carefully then. Okay, take this. You can take your drink. Yeah. So I don't. Okay. So I don't. Okay, bring me climbing down. Oh, okay. Well, be careful then. Don't fall. I I went in this tiny gap here. Um. Yeah. I kind of pulled myself up with my arms, but I could jump over these lines. Yeah. Watch them lines. Stand, jump, stand, stand, on the, stand on the other side of it with both feet and then jump. Put your feet the other side of it. So put your heel on that instead of your toe. Yeah. Oh God, my foot's in the way. you got to remember, bend your legs when you land so you don't hurt your knees. Lee. Bend your legs when you land, you don't hurt Lee. your knees. 
Yeah, man. <laughs> and you have a back now. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is so good. That is really good. Oh my god. Is it actually? Oh, this is really nice. Oh, it's sticking in my back. It's like brown circles going round on your back. Do you think this will loosen your back up and help yeah. a bit? Oh, this, this, this is... Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is great for you, right? Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God, it's squishing my neck. It's <laughs> squishing <laughs> 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 my neck. Can you imagine vibrating my arse? Yes! That's weird. Can we know how my short legs can count? I'm not bad. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's oh, oh my god, I'm, I'm seriously, this is amazing. You can add another coin though, if it helps you back, do it. Oh, I'm serious, Reza. Oh my god. Oh, look at my heart, oh, it's not as good as my hat. This is hilarious. Oh my god. Oh, god. We're in lich. <laughs> Middle of the mall. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> can you hear that? Is that punching back? <laughs> it's got a wobble in your back. <laughs> I'm doing it in your bum game. I'm getting so bored now. What's going on here? I can't see you. Oh, come on. Look at my chest. When you've got this much spinal pain all the time. Okay. I might stop. Oh, no, that's good. Oh, it's got some grub in my spine. We've still got a minute. We've still got two minutes. Right, I'm going to stop recording. Hey, just so you know, you get. What are we doing? Well, I'm having an early birthday dinner. Early birthday dinner. Down. Cheers, guys. Oh, cheers. Happy birthday cheers. to our beautiful boat. Cheers. Cheers, Daddy Cheers. Hang on. I'm, <laughs> cheers. I'm, I'm here. Hi. It's so nice. I'm cold. It's actually a birthday today. No, we come out today. like we come out a bit early to have a meal because we're going to go over to a very um, beautiful Tranquil. but quiet location. Well, I don't think it's a restaurant, so we're having a birthday dinner tonight. Yeah, like an and island. the dog's being a bit of an arse and barking at all the cats because there's, there's so, so many, many stray cats. cats. They're everywhere. So uh, it's not been the most tranquil of dinners, but the dinner was amazing. Dad, did you like dinner? Oh, I love like steak. We're amazing. Uh, the tuna steak. Yeah, we're amazing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's well, didn't you? Yeah. yeah. Alright, that's well, I ate the whole steak. It was about that big. Mimbo did twos. We, she got one thing, I got the other, and we had half half. I loved it. Because we couldn't decide, so we shared. It's the best. Yeah. Happy birthday, Bo. Happy Thank birthday. You. <laughs> Morning. We've come in, got rid of a load of rubbish, took all our bed into the laundry. I found the laundry. Fresh bedding. Oh, it's been way too long. Way too long. I'm like ecstatic. And um, some and some a bag of clothes, because it's always clothes. And now I'm gonna walk in the shade so you can see me. Nope, nope, yep, yep, nope, nope. Oh, sorry. Well anyway, now we're walking to the pet shop to get a nice big nutritional bag of dog food. Because the dog food you get from the supermarket isn't as high in nutrition as um, the stuff you can get from the vets and um Buddy's a puppy still, so it's important that it gets really good nutrition, isn't it? That's my that's my theory. Hang on. What's that say? Is that a cool name? Uh, Nikola Tesla guy. What well, guy? Um... Tesla. You think of Tesla? No. It's spelled different. No, it's. Um... What, is it? what is it now? Electricity or something like that. Who invented electricity? Oh, right. I see. I wonder what he's pointing at that sign. It were a. Were it the dynamo or something invented or something? I have no idea. I find out. Something to do with electricity. I think it was him who, who first produced electricity. I think that's what it was. Lit the light bulb, I think it was. Invent? The Tesla coil. Tesla coil, that's it. <laughs> Clever sod, isn't he? I love this city. It's got a really good feel to this little city. That, I don't know why it'd have that name there. Maybe he owns that building. Or maybe they've just liked the name. Maybe it's somebody else's name. The yeah. This city's lovely. It's got a great feel to it. It's called Budva. Really nice. It's everything you want, but you absolutely off. everything you want if you're a sailor or a tourist or a traveller or anything else, really. It's um, it's really lovely. It's just got a nice feel about it. Like split, didn't you have a nice feel about it? I don't know. It was okay in old town and stuff, but I don't know. You didn't often feel like I don't know, lovely. But I feel lovely here, and it's really easy to walk around. Everything's quite close, and it's just very beautiful. There's like beautiful um, grass gardens you know public ones and you walk around and there's just flowers everywhere 
And it's just really lovely. The buildings are quaint and quiet and cute and look at it, old and new. All mixing together, but like no state. Yeah, it's cool. Really, really cool. Look at them trees. Aren't they beautiful? Look at that. Are you impressed? It's brilliant, isn't it? Amazing, you must have had the right stuff. But that, there. that's the school. So I'm guessing they've done it part of the school, haven't they? It's very cool. We have dog food. Where's expensive dog food? So we got dog food. The first bag I picked up to go, they said 105 euros. 105 pound for a 15 kilo bag of dog food. What cold royal canine though? Does anybody else pay that? Does that I mean, is that normal? No. I've never paid 100 pound for a bag of dog food in my life. Even the special stuff I get handmade for the dog at home and they're delivered to my door doesn't cost me 100 pound a bag. It's crazy, isn't it? And I'm like, you can take that back. I'm not paying that. It was a bit embarrassing, actually, having to say, please give me the money back. I don't want to pay that. I'll have a cheaper bag. That's crazy. What is in that? Gold? You know, this is still 40 some quid, which, is, again, is well, expensive. Yeah, this is... But well, that's 18 kilos. That's 18 kilos, so it's slightly more. It was 46 quid, I think. Something like that. 40 something. Yeah, anyway. Anyway, it is a bit expensive, but um, this should be decent stuff, I hope. I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? Let's hope it is. We'll see. Walking back now, I'm going to get some fresh bread. The little fishermen have been in, so I'm hoping the little fishermen might have some fresh fish and I get some fruit and vegetables. And then we're going to go and anchor on our island and spend tonight there and uh, tomorrow for Bo's birthday with fresh fish. A nice food. This is town. Getting a bit busy now. Cool, huh? Yeah. I like it. Now, my fellow friends, we're going to the market. I got down in and forgot to get cash. Let's go back to get some cash out. Aren't I stupid? I'm not one of them Egyptian, no, no, like Arab man, men. Hey, look, there's two paces behind. Don't worry for walk with me. Anyway, going to market now. Market. Yeah. Look at that. Put your hand there, it's how big it is. Look at the size of it. It's humongous. That's a hole and a half, that bugger. Isn't it? It's coming for you, big boy. <laughs> Are you scared? I don't want that near me. <laughs> If it stings you, you'll know about it and you'll get stung. <laughs> My dad was stung by a hornet, you know. He's got a right scar. Yeah, well, you stick your hand out The size then. of it. That's, that's like, what, a couple of inch long? Maybe an uh, inch and a half? Yeah, but, yeah, good inch. Look at the size of it, it's beautiful. You've got to appreciate that, haven't you? It's the start of the bees' nests. Stop eating bees. You're a thief. Me, honey thief. That is a cool, cool hornet. This is our little celebratory beer look for all the hard work we've done this morning. <laughs> Sneaky beer before we go back for lunch. And watching hornets. It's my birthday tomorrow, so my forehead looks massive. Hi, hope you are. Hi. We're going round to the island. We're going to cross a massive sandbar. So come with us, and I'll show you what we're doing. Cool timing, isn't it? Yeah, very. So we're just... Couldn't have been any better timing. I know, literally. So our friends, who've got the same camera as us, but are 37, uh, slightly, slightly different slogan, have just literally come up and just an answer. Like, well, we're just about to leave. Why don't you just have our moorings? We've, we've checked it. Yeah. And here, if you get within 200 metres of the beach, they come out and fine you 300 odd euros. So they can't find you if you're on a mooring. And no one's charged us for the mooring. No. So they might as well just go on it. I know, that, that was... So that literally, was we come up and they've gone in. <laughs> Better timing, that's fantastic. I know, literally, perfect timing. And now we're going to go over this sandbar, which is two metres deep, all the way across, although so says, but you can get obviously a lot less. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I think it's high if time. You see it, if you go out there, go out there, you'll see it. Okay. If we hit, just hold on, because if it hits down, it might get thrown off the front. Dad, Mum said hold on. Hold. That's not going to stop you. Well, you actually get to it, it's going down, isn't it? Up? Inside. That's the sandbar. Oh, it's not, it's not. It's time. Oh, when you actually get to the sandbar, you can right, right. slow down, yeah? yeah to yeah, the yeah. island. 
it's crazy. <laughs> You'll have to join us next week, guys, to see if we make it across this crazy sandbar and see what troubles that brings. Will we make it to the island? You have to wait and see. Remember, you can find us on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. And if you love what we're doing, become one of our patrons. The link is in the description below. Thanks for following. Thanks for subscribing. And see you next time.